Poke bowls are all the rage right now. They're a fantastic mixture of flavours and textures. I'm making my version today with sea tuna. I've got to admit I was never a fan of tuna steak until my husband Chris made me an amazing meal with seared tuna in a chilli pineapple sauce. I was totally hooked. I'm recreating those flavours today in this delicious poke bowl. We're going to start with the marinade. Add 250ml of pineapple juice to a bowl along with a tablespoon of olive oil. Add around 2 tablespoons of rice vinegar to add a nice tang. Then add 3 tablespoons of light brown sugar to balance out the acidity. I'm also adding ginger, garlic, chilli flakes and dried coriander leaf for lots of flavour. You can place the tuna in the bowl, cover and marinate for a couple of hours in the fridge. I'm going to cut my marinating time down to about 15 minutes using a vacuum bag and the sous vide drawer. Place the tuna steaks in a single layer so the marinade reaches every part of it. Carefully pour in the marinade. There's quite a lot here but we'll be reducing it down later. Place the bag in the sous vide drawer to remove the air. Once marinated, pour the liquid into a pan and reduce by half. Give it a taste and add a little more sugar or vinegar if needed, depending on your tastes. Preheat the griddle on the flexi zone to the highest heat and brush the griddle with oil. Then add those garlicky tuna steaks. They only need a minute or less on each side, just until the griddle lines appear. You can cook for longer if you don't want the tuna to be pink in the middle. Carefully slice up the tuna with a sharp knife. Then sprinkle some brown sugar onto pineapple slices. I'm using fresh pineapple, but tinned is fine too. Place the pineapple on the hot griddle for a minute on each side until beautifully caramelised. I like to use brown rice and lots of fresh baby salad leaves for the base. Then add julienne carrot and beetroot along with cucumber, I'm using sliced baby cucumber, sliced radish and creamy ripe avocado. Top with the caramelised pineapple and that vibrantly pink tuna. Finish with a drizzle of that tangy chilli pineapple sauce. That's my tuna poke bowl. Give it a try and be as adventurous as you like with those ingredients. 